Hello and welcome to the Unusual Fruit Garden. So today I'm going to be planting some Chilean guava, also known as strawberry myrtle. I've got two varieties here. Now, I can't remember off the top of my head which are the names for which ones, so I'll double check online, pause the video and bring the names up now. So there you go, that's the two varieties that I've got. I know this one's generally used by a lot of people as box hedging replacement because it grows very similarly to box hedging. It can be trimmed and uh, shaped however you want it. Uh, but instead of just plain box hedging, it actually gives off edible berries. And the berries are supposed to be like a, a bit of a... like a... chilli strawberry. That's what some people have uh, described them as online. I haven't tried them myself. Uh, I've got two of these and one of that one. Uh, I've just made myself a 1.2 metre planter. I've just managed to squeeze that in next to all of my 2 metre ones. They're all planted up already. This is one of the last few things that I've still got left to plant up. These and the blueberries. So uh, I've just made this planter now. I've just filled the bottom half with a layer of gravel. Then it's got uh, topsoil and compost mixed in. I'm just about to plant them in. And then I've got a couple of pots worth of uh, ordinary topsoil just to fill in and uh, fill in the gaps and get them all bedded in. So I see I've got two here, one of each variety. And then down on my other set of planters down here, I've got another version of the uh, box variety one as well. So that's in its own little planter, just around the corner. And it means that because it's, this one's in a smaller planter, if I do want to move it later on, put it next to the other one, or rearrange it, it's just going to be a case of pulling the planter out and moving it along. So I'm going to get these planted in, and then we're going to see how they progress throughout the year. So there we go, that's the uh, chili and guava all planted up, also known as strawberry myrtle. There are two varieties, so we're just going to have to see how well they progress. Made on my own, 1.2 metre long planter. If you want to see how I've made the planter, have a look at my channel. I've got a couple of videos showing how I make these types of bottomless planters. Really easy, 15 minutes and a couple of quids worth of uh, decking boards and you can get yourself some nice, solid, sturdy planters. So, as I say, subscribe to my channel. I'm going to be documenting exactly how well these chili and guava do. As I say, I've got those two got the one down here as well, and then I've got all sorts of other stuff that I'm going to be documenting on the channel. Uh, I've got funberry, jostaberry, serviceberry, tearberry, and then I've got, uh, as I say, the chili and guava. I've got some honeyberry, wineberry, different types of raspberries. There's going to be a few different types of blueberries as well, and uh, pineberry. So, as I say, subscribe to the channel. There's going to be loads of updates coming just as everything progresses into the spring summertime, and we'll see how everything uh, crops out. Thanks for watching. Cheers.